This is Kushal Pai. He is a senior from Oregon, goes to Sunset High School out in Portland. I ended up showing him that I had an online virtual program and he ended up signing up for that program. So he's been with Leap Squad now since August and so many things have happened. This was his personal best before. You can see the rain clouds in the back because the weather's like that in the Pacific uh, Northwest. However, you bring the speed into the board and you can see that there's just a bent leg. He's not finishing his extension and his knee drive just isn't there. Arms are off balanced. Um, you can see that he's running through that step phase, but he's able to have a good step phase and cover distance. So you can tell that he understands some of the basics and then he goes from there into a double arm. And then the second he gets to a jump phase, he's already visually looking down to land and etc. So mind you, his background was a cross country athlete. So we took a cross country athlete with the personal best of 40 feet to this. From a short 10 step approach, we've been working on just all the basics. We went through the full off season program, went through the full fall conditioning, all the basics. And this was one of his uh, first actual jumps this season. As you can see, he's attacking the board how he was before, but he's in a lot better position upright and stacked. He runs off the board upright. As you can see, he's way more balanced. That drive knee is, is active, and then it drops and relaxes from there. You can see that he has that great hop recovery with his right leg to get into a good position. Now, the things we're still working on, obviously, is having him sweep this leg versus run through. But the main parts of being balanced and stacked are great. And as you can see, he's back into a double arm position already. He swings into that position. You can see that he's balanced. In the step phase, he's able to ride out so much more and allow his arms to load into his landing, leading into his jump phase. And he's up tall, postures upright, and the landing. We'll work on that soon, but we're still working on the beginning part. But as you can see, he looks like, looks like a completely different jumper. And a lot of this is coming down to the basics and mechanics of the jumping form, and understanding uh, the basic elements and getting the body to respond to what's actually happening. So the great thing about it is he's ready to jump far. This being, I believe, a 41 foot jump from 10 steps, it's phenomenal, which means that once we back him up and if he's able to complete his uh, checkpoints and stay, stay balanced, he should be looking at anywhere between 43 to 46 feet. And then obviously if we clean up some of these other issues that he's um, dealing with now, he can easily get up to 47 and, and further. So the great thing about this is Leap Squad works no matter where you are. This is not the first athlete that has been out of state. There has been numerous more, but now I'm just spending the time to educate you guys on um, what's been going on. So stay tuned for more from Kushal this season. I expect him to be doing some really good things. We're going to reset him in his training to make sure that he's ready to go for a great outdoor season and go from there. If you're interested in any type of training, a DVA, Leap, Leap Squad virtual training, or in person, please shoot me an email at info at kenanbriggs.com or you can visit kenanbriggs.com. See you soon. Why aren't you on Leap Squad yet? KenanBriggs.com.